Okay, I'm an ice cream party friend's hotel. Um, she left already. Um, I had a good hangout with her last night. Um, this morning I found that, um, from the girl that I was talking about, um, I was interested in and such, and then, like, was butting heads and again and kind of like and then also kind of contemplating or kind like kind of reconsidering in a way my feelings or something um but i noticed this morning i got a call this morning and apparently it was from her but i didn't i didn't pick it up i didn't know who like i just heard that my phone was over by the was like elsewhere and I just didn't pick it up without knowing who it was but uh later on I was surprised to see that it was from her um and I just messaged like so and so you called but um but um I after the call I had I had heard like when I didn't know who it was I had heard like another beeping so um so I guess I thought that might be a voicemail but then I didn't I must not, I'm, I must have to set up voicemail on this phone. Um, but I, I guess I kind of thought it was a voicemail. And then I like, um, like kind of scrolled my notifications. Um, and I saw something about a voicemail, but I can't, I don't know how to access it right now. It asked for a code and I don't know what the code is. I don't think I've made a code. Um, she might even listen to this video. She might have listened to the video from yesterday, which the video from yesterday was dope, by the way. Like, I just listened to that. Um, it was an hour long of talking, but there is that was a good video. There there are videos that that are longer videos that I could make or that I have made and that don't flow that smoothly. Like it was that was like. It was an hour and two minutes long ish or an hour and three or whatever. And like, I mean, it took, I, I mean, I guess it took time kind of to get through it, but like that just, that was easier to listen to than a lot of other videos of my own that I've listened to. So that, that was cool. Um, but yeah, so this morning I, I noticed that I was, like, taken out of, like, the, um, like, a work opportunity, like, a stagehand opportunity thing this summer um, that I was off that list. And then it seems that I'm also, like, not just on front, but, like, blocked or something from her. So, um, so... Either she saw the video from yesterday and had, and, or, and part of that, either something in relation to the video from yesterday, or maybe because I was like harding, um, harding her photos or something. Um, as a messaging wise, I haven't, I haven't messaged her much, just a heart after all the stuff, all the laying down the law or all the whatnot um like tuesday morning and then send her a link to this dope this dope like rap video from a woman well who i would perceive as a woman i guess it even says in said person's lyrics that they would go by they them pronouns um I've, i i want to say their name is like I I V I K A ivika maybe um I V I K A maybe. Um, but they just had they had this like a re imagining of clout by C Cardi B and offset and like she on something. Like it was a short video, but but yeah, I sent it to said girl because like even though the lyrics include like I'm a god or something like that, which I mean, but I don't know that there's like, if we're going to talk pictures and beliefs, there are certain things that like 
stir me the wrong way and stuff, but it just, it made me think of her. I thought she might like it, but also, but as far as pictures and beliefs, um, I mean, maybe that's something that I should like, I don't know. I get, I guess in reality, like if we're doing this pictures and beliefs stuff, I should, that's something I should maybe, and I, and I maybe even like me, I wonder if my brain even like started to consider in that direction or like that I semi thought of that maybe and try like, so maybe, maybe that semi crossed my mind of like, it like as far as the God thing in those lyrics and then like, um, as far as like the whole pictures belief thing or just trying to let go or something like that. Something like that may have semi crossed my mind, but there are a lot of pictures or beliefs stored up, small and big, I suppose, that might carry energy with them. Um, But yeah, that video was was a good reflection and was not like was I mean, at points even like fun, like that was a good video, even though it was like an hour and something minutes. So that's cool. Um, and it might not even be that I'm taking off that summer thing. It might just be that like off of her blocking me or whatnot, that it automatically um, takes me off of that group thing. But, but if, even if it was okay, if she, if she wanted space or if she wants that, then, you know, what she, it might not be that she wants me off of that too, but even if she did, or even if she thinks she doesn't like what, I, like, if she wants space or needs space or something. Either way, it's between her, there's just like, I mean, as long as I don't lose it or, I mean, well, I mean, everything kind of fades over time, kind of. But like, there's just humility and like learning in my experience with her of recent, like the fit, the amount of feelings that I had the the like almost reconsidering love at, and then maybe almost finding my way back to it whatever was going just recent stuff with her in the in recent days recent weeks like including monday there's just there's just um like she doesn't even like hugs like to be able to go to someone's place and to like to not be able to hug them even really to like just help them with something um like there's just elements of in recent and then in past weeks too maybe between the between the level of being smitten hanging out with her on monday and and then even even with like how she was like like shark attack at, at a certain point Tuesday morning, like how that led me to feel like in, in trying to like, um, or in coming up with a solution or thinking of stuff with that, like to be able to see like how I could see high potential. So even if it's that she like removes herself from me, like I've still learned and whether we meet each other in some fashion down the road or whether it's just stuff that I carry on in my growing in my development towards whoever my future partner will be. Um, shoot, this is another on the road to you video. Um, but it isn't because this is the road of light and we are only doing the road of light videos for these hundred videos. Um, speaking of which I noticed something. Um, and if I remember, I'll talk about it maybe immediately after I'm done with this stuff. Um, or semi or just round up stuff on this front. But uh 
Yeah, but even the person that she was defending in the past when we had that big budding head situation before um, that I had romantic startings with, even from that, there is like a le- like something ca- to be learned or kind of learned there. May- or I don't know, there's something kind of there with like, because this is someone that like physically it wasn't like they were 100% everything, all that. But I saw deep treasure in this other person, um, that current person had defended and had issue with, I mean, both of them had issue with the video, even though current person kind of initiated that, which is something I, there's aspects of that situation that, because I'd like brought up to current person that like, I think I found love or there's or something. And like, I had like brought that up when I was checking up on another coworker that I was concerned about or kind of coworker, maybe, I guess you could say another non coworker kind of, but he had got like kicked out of the gig or something. Not, maybe not our same, same venue, different position or whatever, but he had got kicked out. So, and he is a mutual friend or something. So I like asked her like if he was okay and then brought up she maybe she asked how I I don't know if she would have asked how I was, but the initial thing was if he was okay or whatever, checking up on him and then somehow like just checking up on each other, or maybe one of us did the other or something, and then maybe the other reciprocated it, I don't know, but brought up that like I thought I'd found love and da 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 and like so I'd already like told her about that and like and then she ended up telling, she so she must have ended up seeing a, the YouTube video or a YouTube video where I was like, maybe down the road um, about like love struggles or whatever. Um, and then like on the road to you, there's like three videos in the Heartfeltization series. Um, but like the, the, the person that I was like, had a romantic stories with back then, um, like messaged me one night and I was like anxious just off of like, because it was, it was a short, it was probably a short message, but it was just like, um, it was like polite demanding is how I would say it. But, um, but so I was just anxious off of that. And then like, but then later on, like I asked, like, cause I, I was like, did so is so and so the person that sent you or that you heard about it from or that sent it to you or however I worded it and it was. And then I asked, like, have you even like watched all of the videos or all the like whatever? And she hadn't. I think she I think she maybe had started to, but even that is already like so and then and I conversed with that person, not the current person, but with that person. Um, we backed and forth some, but then there was one time that I sent all this stuff, like said all this stuff. And then she was just like, please don't try to validate, not, um, like, or please, like, please don't try to validate, um, violating my consent. Like all this, all this stuff that I said, like all this content and that that's all that she was focused on. And like, with with social justice and social justice like related like minded people it's like they come up with stuff that in reality isn't per se a hundred percent just like nonsense but they just like come up with these ideas or these points and it's like and they and it's like whoever doesn't ride on that same boat is just trash that's like and so like even with this like mind valley stuff with this like recent duality energy work or whatnot stuff and pictures. And I mean, I mean, obviously more than pictures, but like there's ways to see the world. Even in relation to like, just ideas that like a bunch of people have flocked around and to be able to see some, like, there's way, there's, via the energy work, duality stuff, there's 
another lens kind of with which to see or see through the world or see the world or something. And maybe it'll be a combination of like energy work. Um, I don't know if you could still say Christianity, but I, but I guess that goes, I mean, I don't know. There's different things that go into my lens and energy work is, I don't know. Maybe you wouldn't say it's its own lens, but it maybe adds to my lenses or something. Um, yeah, even with, cur with current, like, potential love interest, which maybe now is not a thing, but, um, but just to reiterate again, that she vocally at least, or text-wise, did, did not, um, did not, was not interested, but, um, even with current person, it's like, it's, it's, it's a woman, it feels like a woman thing, but you can see it in, you can see it in guys too. I think just as a guy, I, um, like, I just more readily see it in women. And for women, it might be the same with seeing things in men that just seem like such a men thing, but in reality, maybe it's women too. But the thing I'm talking about now is, um, like just how, like only, only being able to see something a certain way. And I see that with like current person, um, that's definitely a thing with social justice people. That's thing with people with pride about their cultures. You know, whether you're talking about black people, I had a dude, a black dude, maybe a week ago or so come up to me and talk to me about, I don't know if he was saying that I should be like getting all these like B I T C H E S S or something. And like how I should stop playing or something. And like that I'm a God or something. And like, like, but I, like, I don't know how many people hear this if you're not black, but they, I've heard it from more than one black person that it's to the level that some black people think we're like gods now. And like, but like, so like uniquely us, like uniquely black people. And like, whether, you know, if you like the dude in the living room with the mother of the person connected to this band, like he has a lot of Native American pride. Um, there's just with culture, with whatever, like there's just ways that people get into where like if we're talking pictures they got charged pictures like or they got just there's just stuff that people get stuck on and they cannot like with this current person or current love interest or just past love interest if that's what it's at that like she like she just sees her way and is off to the races with it i see that in a woman and i feel like that's a woman thing but if i think about it even though it's like like going against myself or like being unnatural in a way with my whatever I men do that too where they're just like yeah like even I mean the boyfriend of the mother of the person connected to this band like he gets I don't know what he's got going on mentally but I don't know how his stuff works but um okay so with what I was gonna say earlier but that I said I wanted to like round up stuff um, I know I've noticed in the past week or something that um, my video count for this channel, it, it's and I, I must have I must have like been conscious of this at some point in the past. But like the first hundred videos were like there there's a hundred videos and then I started the road of light. So the road of light like. So this is like maybe the 84th or the 85th video in the Road of Light series. This is like, so that would be like, if, if it's my 84th or 85th Road of Light video, then it's like my 184th or 185th video altogether in this channel. So what I'm thinking is that I'll alternate between 100 videos of just like whatever and then 100 like focused videos. And that's the path that I think I'll take. Um, that's what I think I'll do. Um, also, something that I kind of thought of today. So 2020 Insight from, I mean, I could say however many years ago, but since the year is literally in the title. Um, let's see, that would have finished by 2020. So beginning of 2021 to the beginning of 2023. So two plus years ago maybe. Um, you know, when I finished 2020 Insight, you know, I felt like I was just in a certain space, right? Like I felt 
you know, I even got myself like, uh, bought myself this black basketball, um, uh, that's currently in my storage unit. And like, it was like a commemoration maybe, or I don't know. I don't know if it was something to remind me of, or just a staple of my accomplishments or something, but yeah, it was special. Like I got to a certain space, like a certain mode via 2020 insight. But then in the beginning of 2021, there was stuff that threw me off my horse and God can do that. Um, I mean, at least unless that's the devil or something, but I mean, whatever, I guess, whatever way you would process that, but God can do that. Um, like, you know, it's kind of like when I keep wanting to go in these dark, you know, when stuff really hurts me and I want to go in like these dark, this dark mode or something like even like a year or two ago where I had like the first person that I made out with and I like, and you know, you would think that would be like the direction of at least considering a relationship or potential. And then she was just like, like just talking about like, we're just friends or something after we just had like a night, like a, a, like a night of making out and just like, and whatnot. And like that, we just be friends. Like what, like for me, the trajectory should be like, cons at least considering now that it has to for sure be for sure, I guess, but like tr that should be the tra trajectory or something. And like that just, um, I mean, we talked and we kind of like, whatever, after that point, even though we, it wasn't communication or what I was trying to say, wasn't getting across to her, wasn't like making sense to her, but like at the end of that situation, like, or maybe not the end, but somewhere along there, it was, I, I like almost, there, it's always like this dark light path or the, or light, dark, whatever, dark light or whatever way you would want to say it like this, like dark mode, but like where like my focus or my objectives are still kind of light or something like that I want to get into. And this is just always a thing since more or less, um, um, like, like I've said, even I remember in like elementary school in recess feeling of feeling in like off of undertaker from WWE or F, um, dead man walking like the, like that theme or thinking that in my head but like at least in recent years there will be times where like it's just, i guess i'm just not supposed to go to that um i didn't think of all that that i just said uh this word or whatever but um i guess the idea that like i don't know <laughs> that god like because with 2020 Insight, I reached a certain space. Um, and in that case, you know, not the light, dark or dark light thing, but a certain space. And then I was knocked off of that in the next weeks, months or whatever from things that were hard for me, like social situations, like with people, um, you know, some, yeah, a couple hurtful girl or three, maybe. Oh, my gosh. Dang. Was that were all three of those in the same months or there were like, there were three, maybe up to three, maybe more. I don't know. But like girl situations um, that maybe were part of this same period um, and maybe none of which I've mentioned, like girl stuff or whatever I've talked about so far in this video, the three in that early 2021, none of them may be ones that I've talked about so far in this video, potentially. Um, and then there was one like group situation that also related to a girl actually though, or girls actually. Um, so, but yeah, so I mean, finishing the road of light or at whatever the road of light, I may feel like I'm getting to a certain place, but I mean, if I could stay focused regardless of what happens, then maybe I can hold on to it, but the storm will come unless I can focus, beat these patterns, beat these cycles.
Also, um, in part of the video yesterday, I was talking about how, uh, um, tour, like maybe in somewhere in the second part of the video yesterday, I already did my mind Valley for today, by the way. Um, but some point in the video, in the YouTube video yesterday that I was reviewing yesterday and today, um, but the parting question, I think I noticed today, um, there's like a thing of like, um, that like after this duality thing that I'll need a voice, I don't know if it could be God's voice. Um, but there's that thing of like, I need a voice. Maybe God could be that voice. I don't know, but a voice like after Jeffrey Allen isn't in my daily so that I can have like that kind of gives life to this stuff or gives me, I guess, gives me permission or however I worded it or whatever the reality is or potential reality is or proposed potential reality is. But, um, I realized, um, like the Bible from a, like, and I've already talked about how, like, you know, there's all these cookie crumbs and like, including the, the trial thing, um, that for some reason crossed my mind or passed my mind in past thinkings or something, I think, but, uh, like the Bible would potentially be, you know, cause that's with all the Jesus stuff, as far as cookie, cause there's cookie crumbs in this chat, in this, not this channel, in this series, I've talked about how there's like, on uh, the journey to, on the journey in relation to Jesus stuff and on the journey in relation to finding that special someone there's crumbs or whatnot. Um, and like regarding like Jesus and what, and my path or whatnot or religions or whatever, maybe you could call that my spiritual path or whatever. Like talked about the Jesus cookie crumbs, the Jesus crumbs. And like with what I was talking about in a portion of yesterday's video, just a portion of an hour long video that who knows, maybe it was just a portion that was five minutes, 10 minutes. I don't know, but there's, or maybe even a few minutes. I don't know, but there's a sentiment of like, after this, after this like duality thing, after this quest, however I worded it, like that I need a voice to give life to this stuff or so that I can keep like I, and I even said like, maybe like, unless God could be that or something, but like the Bible, like, could be that hypothetically but then you know on tuesday i talked about how like i was watching um my friend's um ramadan thing and you know not that i've not that i haven't heard the concept of how like the quran or prophet muhammad got the final revelation or that whole final relation final revelation stuff in relation to islam not that i haven't heard that before but that kind of hit me a certain way on um, that tuesday so like The Bible would be a potential and it would be like, a, and it would be a different lens to let, because I don't know if it's my third read through. It might be my third read through of the Bible that I realized this, but like there's the literal and there's the like metaphorical, but like, and people usually think it's one or the other, but I th it's potentially both. It's potentially that these things did happen. And that they also carry metaphorical meaning or whatnot. But, you know, and, and Christians will always be like, read the Bible, read the Bible and like pray that God shows you stuff or whatever. And like, I mean, if I were to try to look for what I'm looking for, or like what I'm this, this type of stuff in the Bible that could maybe fit into met metaphorical, but it could partially or somewhat be its own thing too. But, um, I mean, cause that's what like people, there's some people that would just like open random, I think maybe that just open random parts of the Bible. And, uh, and you know, like, yeah, I've been told to like pray before you read it or something. And like that stuff is almost like nonsense to me of like versus like to just be able to like, just read it and hear, I don't know. I don't know. Um, 
one thing with spir- with spiritual text is that I want to I generally want to read it myself and not have people telling me how to perceive things or just or kind of uh um spoiling like with like a movie or a book like when people like tell you or influence your it's almost like spoiling something like someone tells you the plot before it happens or just ruins the story experience for you like when it comes to spiritual text like i want to just read it or experience it for myself kind of thing um and so i have to i've had to watch out for that like when i was reading the bible that third time um maybe when i was reading the book of mormon maybe um but um But like, there's there's things that Christians be saying about like, ju- or even if they want, even if they're just like, go home and pray to and pray about like you know on their kind of desires to convert you or or just I don't know, I don't, maybe that's not the right way to say it. Maybe, but like in their efforts, maybe we could say that like they might be like, just go home and pray about it or I don't know whatever they. Just, stuff they'd be saying, but in light of what I said yesterday, I mean, there's even that verse in the New Testament that's like, the word was with God and the word was God and how everything in the world is through the word. That's not verbatim, but that's hopefully kind of the idea and the word being Jesus, I would think. And so like, so there's, there's two, there's two paths kind of to don the bible after this because with all these jesus crumbs and with what i just like desired or proposed or reflected on in part of yesterday's video like to to don the bible and to go about that in some fashion or to and this might be the move too to like seek god's voice or like or try to be more big picture than that because you know there's all this energy there's all this focus there's all this like the bible is everything but like you know the the quran is supposed to be the final revelation of um of uh um it's supposed to be the final revelation or even the book of mormon has jesus in it too and like is but people just like put everything on the side burner and just the bible so, but Jesus, like in my, in the crumb situation, you know, there's the, with the Jesus or the, or with Jesus or with, um, you know, maybe religions, maybe my spiritual journey in general, but like with Jesus and then with, um, on the road to a significant other or something, there's crumbs or like experiences or whatnot. But as far as the Jesus side of that, um, and like in this channel, I've just, or not this channel, in this series, I've just kind of like, it's come to be that I pair these in a way that I talk about crumbs towards, I mean, they're, in reality, maybe there's crumbs towards something else, but this is what I'm noticing, focusing on, I guess, is the Jesus and the significant other. Um, I mean, in reality, I could do, there could be crumbs towards something else too, but um. But yeah, like, but if not the Bible, then what would I, what would I make God's voice or like, or would I, or would I just pray or do I just pray maybe like, should it not be the Bible or should it be the Bible? Like, cause the, but it would be constrict, like, I don't know. Because there's enough crumbs towards Jesus that like the Bible, but the Bible being the Jesus thing, or the Bible potentially, or being the Bible being portrayed as it is, is off of like people believe this and that and put all this energy or put or have all this belief or portray the Bible as this thing, but like. And so that, I mean, but does, I 
I mean, is everything just within the Bible, the way that people think like, does the Bible deserve all the energy or, or faith or, um, black and whiteness or just enclosed world view? Does it deserve, or is that all that? And is it all that? Like there's people that say that, Oh, the Bible's man-made or whatnot. And like, I don't ride that train really, but, um, like, does it do do i because the the bible would be a an answer to what i was like to to use the bible would be a, a like in light of what i was saying in that part of yesterday's video would be a thing otherwise to not be bound by the bible and to seek god's voice be like beyond that but yeah we're gonna watch dozens and dragons tonight um and i'm well rested because i slept here and we had a good ice cream party we had another ice cream party um i this is the first thing i've ever like i think that i've ever like i mean i brought her the leftover cake cookies but then she didn't even end up eating those like i and when i say i brought her the leftover cake cookies like not all of them, like, the girl had, like, one, I think, and then I think I ate everything else except for two, if I'm not mistaken, and then her guy ended up eating the last two I found out last last night, I think, um, maybe, or recently, he, I found out that he must have eaten the last two, because it wasn't me, um, so, her guy also gave me, um, Tuesday morning gave me a football to like give to some kid in a, in the theater. I was going to give it to like the people that, you know, I thought maybe I might give it to someone who works there, but I ended up scouting this, uh, like a, what must've been parents and some kids, um, that were around the fountain, like the drink fountain or pop fountain place for a while. Um, so I like went back to the lounge, I went to the lounge area and got, um, my, um, cup that I kept refilling that day and that movie day and, uh, and the football. And they were like walking away from the, from the fountain area or the pop area or whatnot. And I like got their attention and like they, the first, they were the first people that I asked and they took it. It was like, I don't know what to, oh, Packers. It was a Packers football thing. And it was like still in its, uh, container or whatever. Um, but yeah, maybe, I mean, it's already 1234. Maybe I should, maybe I'll shower, maybe not. Maybe I should just go to the, to the library and try to do some tech stuff that way. Um, because yesterday, you know, I was able to work on stuff, um, except for library stuff. And now, you know, maybe I should just, I have like 40 something dollars in my account. I have a 40 whatever dollar check from yesterday. I think yesterday. Um, with that apartment garage thing. So yeah, that would have been yesterday, um, that I can put in my bank account. Um, so, I mean, I could have a few hours or some hours on, um, the computers and I'd be able to do what I wasn't able to do yesterday, or at least make some, some movements on that front. It looks like I won't be working today. I could have, I could have like, cause we, we were up for a while. Like we, we had the ice cream with hot fudge on the side or whatever. We like, we're playing kids music to each other. <laughs> like, so I shared, um, after she shared all her stuff, I shared like a hip hop Harry song and, uh, oh, I think she's back, but I shared like a, a hip hop Harry song and, uh, so <laughs> hey, I did. Was there like a fight going on or something? Yeah. Between that couple. Oh, I don't know. She threw a drink at him. Oh, his shirt's all wet. No. He's on his way here. Oh, is he? Yeah, I dropped him off at Burger King. Oh, okay. I'm like, no, I didn't go to the bathroom. And I'm about to go to my but yeah, I, sh I, sh I shared like hip hop here with it. I was talking, the last thing I was talking about was our ice cream party thing. But I shared, uh, I shared hip hop Harry song and then, uh, 
you know, the kids bought version of a, of a um, Pitbull or whatever that I definitely like more than Pitbull's version. I gotta go with that one. Oh, touche. <laughs> <laughs> Wrong direction. Um, so yeah, but it was a, it was a good hangout. Um, but yeah, but because of, but so I ended up sleeping late though. So I didn't spend too much time on the birthplace, on the listening to a heart filterization video. Um, the video I watched yesterday was only a few minutes, but, uh, but yeah, I still slept kind of late. I could have, I mean, I would have had to go to work off of like, excuse me, like five hours of sleep or something. Four, four, I don't know, four or five hours, but I prioritize sleep, I guess. And so I have sleep, but not more money. <laughs> but as we talked about yesterday, there are other types of value than money. Um, yeah. <laughs>